Right guys, what have we here? Another video for you all. Uh, I will be reacting to, or watching, Charles Barkley until I'm impressed. Number 16 on the list of the top 30 NBA players of all time. Charles Barkley. Uh, I never saw him play. Uh, wouldn't know a nickname if he had it. Chuck, apparently. I've just read that there. I didn't. I actually didn't know that. But what I have seen him is obviously on the, you know, he's... He's kind of like Shaq. He's all over the place. He, he's he's a personality within the world of basketball, right? Within the world of ESPN. The only real thing that I've seen is him th uh, swing a golf club. And it was, um, well, it was, geez, it certainly wasn't impressive. Um, <laughs> it was, I think he's improved. I feel like he's improved. Either way, guys, we're looking at, geez, what's his name again? Charles Barkley. Until I'm impressed. Prior to that, prior to looking at his video, we will read through his blurb. Crazy that Chuck is now underrated. Underrated? It's because he's been playing too much golf. A member of the NBA 75 team, people forget that he dominated for years as a 6'6 six six power forward. Now, I didn't think he was 6'6. Six six. I did not think he was 6'6. Six six. And I certainly didn't think he played power forward. But you learn something new every day. The mound round of rebound was a beast on the boards, averaging 11.7 for his career, even with his down years in Houston. Barkley couldn't be stopped off offensively either, beating out Jordan for the 93 MVP and taking his new team, the Suns, to the finals where he lost to Jordan's Bulls in six. Chuck played bigger than he was, even though he is six foot six. I mean, slamming dunks on motherfuckers' heads for fun and was way more athletic than he was perceived. Early in his career, he was quicker and stronger than everyone else, but as he got older, he was able to add more finesse to his game. Barkley started jaying people up and shooting threes. Jaying people up. Now, jaying people. What does that actually mean? Let's, let's get into that. Might be an urban dictionary for you. Jaying people definition. Um, <laughs> oh, come on, man. Jaying people. Now, what does that mean? Does that mean Jordaning people? Does that mean J... Jay walking people. Look, I, I've actually got no fucking clue. Jaying people up and shooting threes. Jaying people. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, getting them off balance. I'm thinking, crossing them over, and shooting a nice three. Uh, forcing opponents to guard from all over the court and not just on the block. He was always one of the most entertaining players on, on and off the court, leading him to becoming an Emmy Award-winning studio host on Inside the NBA. The younger generations get to enjoy the Chuckster in ways older NBA fans never imagined. For you guys, no, there's still never been a player quite like him. Okay, six foot six power forward, averaging 11.7 boards per game his entire career. All right, guys. Charles Barkley. <laughs> Funny moments on Dirk Nowitzki, golf swing, San Antonio. There's no highlights. Well, the Suns highlights. I'm, I'm going to write it in for you guys. I'm going to write it in. Charles Barkley. Highlights. I mean, clearly he's been to different teams. Charles Barkley, career highlights. Here we go. He has what I call the heart of a champion. He always played to win. He always Jeez, he does look. He looks like fucking Tony saw. Parker. And he, along with guys like Jordan, Bird, Johnson, and Elijah Wan, has made the NBA what it is today, the best sport in the world. Six, six. Oh! <laughs> no one wants to block him. Ain't no one wants to block him. It's certainly not Larry Bird. Get the fuck out of my way, Lazza. Either way, I'm impressed. Thanks, guys, and, uh, well, best of luck on the golf course, mate. See you later.